Orders are orders. We can't let them get away with this. to tell us. I must talk to you about the Orders are orders. She won't talk to the police. I give up. be arresting? You know who? By now? Ah, John is not going anywhere. can't let them get away with this. What's your... Orders are orders. Ah, Pretty obvious anyway. what happened here. What's your hurry? Are you general? I was given the same orders you were, sir. This doesn't concern you. I must talk to I you know. about what happened. Orders are orders. I know all about our orders. This was can't let them get away with me. It. it was just a matter of time before they got her. Before who got her? She's that journalist. The one writing all those things about you know who. You'll have to fill me in. Radko Maximilian Petty? The local anti-Alg politician? That's Angela Gunn lying there. She's the one that's been writing about him. There was a threat of a scandal and everything. Coincidence? It's important to follow the evidence in situations like this. You can't just accuse people left and right. I gave you evidence. I told you. The articles. Right. Other than that, is there anything else that makes you think this politician might be responsible? Damn right there is. Fucker told my car once. When he was municipal transport minister. I see. I hate that guy so much. Did you actually see anything? I just got here. So I see what you see. A dead, augmented journalist. Thanks. Maybe tomorrow. Gruesome, isn't it? We can't let them get away with this. Daria says something, but apparently she doesn't talk to cops. Away from We can't crimes. let them get away with this. I recognize you. We're neighbors. I've seen you in our building. You're very difficult to miss. By chance, did someone send you to investigate? No, no one sent me. What happened here? It's horrible. An augmented woman was killed, just outside of where we live. She looks like she was my age. It's so sad that nothing will be done about this. Org victims are not high on the list of police priorities. To them, it's like a dog lying in the street. You... you're not a cop, by you? I was a cop, once. Old habits die hard. In America? Yeah, Detroit. It was a long time ago. I bet you have a lot of experience. You're used to this sort of thing. What about you? What's your interest in all this? Morbid curiosity? Oh, no. I want nothing more than to go home. Detective Montag, he's making me stay. He, he thinks I saw something. Did you see something? Maybe. I think I would rather not say, to be honest. Because if I had seen something, and if I started talking about it, wouldn't that put me in danger? You may not think much of the police here. I may not think much of them either. But that doesn't mean you should hold back information. They don't have it in them to protect me. They have neither the will nor the courage. Be that as it may, it's still probably your best hope for helping to catch the killer. I know. It's just that I don't trust the police. I would feel safer with someone like you. You have more reason to be invested in this than they do. You're augmented, like the victim was. And you look like you could actually protect me. It's not my case. But maybe you could help. Please, neighbor. Talk to Detective Montag. At least see how it's going. Make sure he doesn't think he's on vacation just because the victim is an orc. I'll talk to the officer in charge and see where he is with the investigation. If I can help him, I will. Thank you. Suppose I end up remembering something later. Is there a way for me to contact you? You planning to run off on me already? The first chance I get. 
There are times for standing in the cold, but this isn't one of them. I just want to go home, bolt the door, and never come out again. Of course, I will wait for Detective Montag to say it's okay first. And I'll still try to answer whatever questions you may have. I can give you access to my info link. You should feel free to use it if you have to. Thank you, neighbor. Talk to you about what happened. How come she talks to him and not to me? So, Daria was actually talking to you, huh? I could barely get two words out of her. What did she say? Did she see anything? You mean your witness over there? She's... She's not sure yet. <laughs> How can she not be sure? Either she saw something or she didn't. She's scared. She thinks she might be in danger. I told her she'll be fine and that whoever did this would be caught. I'd like to believe that's true. Sure, so would I. But as you can see, the victim was like you. Augmented. That makes things a little more complicated, eh? Being a cop in this city, it's not always about doing the right thing. Or about doing things the right way. I was a cop for 12 years. I know all about getting bad orders. The difference between what you're told to do and what you know is right. Tell me about it. So, how did you reconcile yourself with uh, those kinds of orders? I quit. <laughs> I'm two months away from the beach. I'm not quitting. But I respect your idealism. It was a long time ago. I work for Interpol now. Interpol, huh? Listen, off the record, I've been told to forgo any unnecessary investigation. I want you to know, it's not my idea of how things should be done. Who told you to forgo the investigation? <sighs> Men who spend more time making policies than arrests. They want the victim's husband, Johnny Gunn, ex-PMC operative. Heavily augmented. All right. So if you're not comfortable with this, if you know things aren't being handled the way they should, why not do something about it? I thought I just did. Just because my hands are tied doesn't mean Interpol can't conduct a parallel investigation. Crime scene's right over there, and Johnny lives just a couple of blocks from here. I never said I was going to work your case for you. Sure you did. Isn't that more or less the promise you made your little friend over there? She won't talk to a cop because she doesn't trust us. Smart girl. Look, my orders are to arrest the husband. You take a look around, get to Johnny before my guys do. Who knows? Maybe we'll actually learn something. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, careful of you. Who do they think they are? Found something. I don't know what's going on here. Away from the crime scene, sir. Would you piss off for this duty? Oh. 
Doesn't it feel like something is about to happen? Oh. Uh, it makes me scared to leave my home. <laughs> 